just imagine what Wilco could have done for the sport if he'd fully embraced it. If you remember when he was going through, he did that advert with Beckham and if he'd have just fully got on that that train, you could ask where would we have gone? And I think Owen's probably at the same place now where, yes, he's not comfortable with it, but I think you're right. He should be told that you could do a ma- you could do a massive good for the sport if you could get out there more. And he has done stuff with Red Bull before, which I saw quite cool and... Um, and and other bits and pieces but it doesn't have to go away from his character bring his character into it and do it in the right way but actually get him out there because he plays with passion which everyone wants in a rugby player he he leads he wants to play for his country more than anything in the world i think you feed on all those good points of him then you do get the you get the other side to what people sometimes sit on the field and judge i think with owen as well you know the bloke i know is someone very very kind uh, you know, very supportive, very, you know, an amazing sort of family man, just a, a really lovely guy, loves a laugh, loves a joke and everything else. It's, so, you know, I think, uh, yeah, it would be good to see more of that. I genuinely, though, this, this, you know about Johnny Wilkinson? So for years, about 2003, four, five, six, when, we, when I was playing um, with Wasps, I would honestly come into the change room and sit down and go, do you know what would happen if I was Johnny Wilkinson? If I had his looks, his ability and that level of fame, I wouldn't have been in Hollywood I would have probably married Angelina Jolie. I, we would have been global. There would have been action, action figures. I, David, I would literally be everywhere with David Beckham. And, we, and the boys used to laugh. They go, that's why you don't have that power. That's why your rugby career is never going to go anywhere. I, I, honestly, I think I said it to Johnny after a couple of beers. I was like, mate, what I would have done if I was you, you would never have seen anything like it. Uh, Michael Jordan, Ronaldo, forget about it. Rugby would have been, I, I would have either detonated rugby or it would have been incredible. You, I would have been like, hanging out with Tom Cruise, I would have been in movies. Mate, it would have been unbelievable. So you're saying you wouldn't have been playing hacky sack in your back garden, mate, Johnny? Hacky sack in the garden. <laughs> would, would, would I be coming down to England to do extra kicking sessions with the lads? I wouldn't be speaking to any of you anymore. You wouldn't get anywhere near me. You'd get to a PR person. I'd just be like, Mike Tinder wants you. Who? Wouldn't even go. Wouldn't even matter to me because I'd be like I'm hanging out with you know, Jack I get, Nicholson. I, I get that now anyway. So that, <laughs> yeah, I get, yeah, 